Hmm. Does the screen look cleaner to you? Found the brightness issue. <coughs> Am I seeing things anyway? Blah, blah, blah. blah. Now, sir. Bunch of signing parts of the Bible. Bible, whatever. Holy word, are we going to discuss today? Oh. Yes. <coughs> the child grew and was weaned. And on the day Isaac was weaned, Abraham held a great feast, but Sarah saw the son of whom Hagar, the Egyptian, had bore, <coughs> to Abraham with mocking, and, and then she said to Abraham, Get rid of that slave woman and her son, for that woman has son will never share the inheritance with my son Isaac. <coughs> the matter distressed Abraham greatly because he considered his it his son. But God said to him, Do not be distressed about the boy and your slave woman. Listen to whatever Sarah tells you, because it is through Isaac that your offspring will be reckoned. I will make the son of the slave woman into a nation also, because he is your offspring. Early the next morning, Abraham took some food and a skin of water and gave them to Hagar. Hagar. He set them on her shoulders, and then he sent her off with the boy. She went <coughs> She went on her way and wandered to wandered in the desert of Beersheba. When the water in the skin was gone, she put the boy under one of the bushes. Then she went off and sat down and No, sat down about a broom shoot away. And no, it does not give a translation to what that is. Just, I don't know, take the handle of a broom and use that as a reference. For she thought, I cannot watch the boy die. And as she sat there, she began to sob. <coughs> God heard the boy crying, and the angel of God called to Hagar from heaven and said to her, What is the matter, Hagar? Do ye not be afraid. God has heard the boy crying as he lies there. Lift the boy up and take him by the hand. For I will make him into a great nation. Then God opened her eyes, and she saw a well of water. So she went and, f and filled the skin with water and gave the boy a drink. God was with the boy as he grew up. He lived in the desert and became an archer while he was living in the desert. 
a paran. His mother got a wife for him from Egypt. I'm pre-Egyptian in origin. Yeah, Egyptian. <coughs> Anyway, good bye.